So this is a classic example of Jennifer and I. <laughs> what do we call this? The Peter Principle. Is it the Peter Principle? Where when something, everything that could go wrong actually does. So we are back live and we are composed and we are hoping we we're really hoping that we gotten all of you back on with us what happened there is that internet just went down and we were able to go onto the telephone to use our connectivity we were just talking about how important it is for us to have knowledge of different types of technology so that we can be connected in this world this digital world that we live in okay so jan is back with us now we are much more cozy and we're using a very small screen so yes Great. okay it tells us we can't rotate, rotate the, the phone, phone at this stage so we are sharing one, one share, share. Jennifer. Listen to me. This is an entrepreneurial journey. Shelly Ann Collins. And nice this to see you. is where we have to be very flexible. We have to also understand each other in this journey. Yeah. Mm. I was really trying to switch back to the to computer. the um, computer. But what I am thing. not sure of is if we do that. I wouldn't like us to to lose, to, again. To lose again because we have we have a time mm -hmm. and we don't want to keep you back yeah. we even tried because we didn't plan to use the phone before we don't have it rotated and that takes up time yeah. so bear with us what we can probably do after Terian which mm -hmm. is very flexible we could redo we could redo a tape for you well I think everybody is right back if it comes to that yeah so, so would you all give us some more time because I think we need to talk about our video all right okay so because we're talking about the entrepreneurial mindset and we are saying that in your third act you have to be prepared to take control of your destiny Jen, you have to come around some more and then want to be really cozy <laughs> cozy <laughs> you have to take control of your destiny yeah and i found you all may have seen the video that was circulating the animals at the river and a wildebeest his hind hoof is caught in an alligator's jaw. I hope you all got a chance to look at it. And the commentary really spoke about what goes on during this journey. Yeah. You know, and as Jennifer and I reflected, and we'd like to see your comments. It's a two minute video. So even if you're on Connect site, you can look at it very quickly and join the discussion. Jen, there are so many parts so many participants there's the wildebeest in the river yes and a river crocodile has his foot in its grip and we can see that's a death grip and his family is on the the river bank his friends and <laughs> friends and family on the river bank and everybody looking on. is looking on and you what are see, they doing i would interpret that terian especially when you're bringing it home to our journey mm that they are some may be scared because if Paralyzed. they go in there to that water to help they may also be trapped because they and don't know yes. how many more alligators right are there. and and so that is one two they are also looking on maybe with with praying <laughs> praying that he gets through it you know um but you know it's amazing that none of the horde is thinking of let's all charge into the water and try to overwhelm the adverse situation don't it, we all feel like that sometimes it could be that you're waiting to see who going first and nobody Maybe moves. if somebody attempt and say look let me go and help the others will come too yeah but when you relate it even with with this situation mm -hmm. with uh, you know the entrepreneurial journey you find that you step out there and you say I am going this is what I believe in yeah. I am setting up business or if not setting up business this is the route I want to take in life and what's that alligator right. cash flow <laughs> and that is it and while you're doing that you others sitting back may think who do they think they are 
yeah. they are stretching themselves. They, they, there is a saying that uh, that is from the old days. You hang in your what? You hang, you hang in your, your hand where your hand reach. can't reach and this sort of thing. So they're sitting at the sidelines. Who are you feeling yeah. that you could do business? Who are you feeling so that you, you could do So you have those there? who are the sidelines just watching on. Yeah. They're not attempting, but if someone gets on board and that person the seem that Hi, is also <laughs> successful, you will find that they will also get on board. Yeah. But they are waiting. Now, if he had gotten away quite easily, they may have surrounded him, him. or congratulated yeah. him. You know, you and know? as we get on to our third act, you know, before we had our interruption, we were saying that you've got to identify your tribe. Oh, yes. You've got that to is identify important. those supporters. And it's not always going to be the family or the friends that have known you all the time. It's going to be somebody who is willing to, even if they're not going to come in the water when you're grasped, they're going to be there supporting you, helping you along. Yes. You know, the next thing we saw in that that video the wildebeest himself and jen i remembered something you said last week yeah you said when you go onto that journey don't panic yes you can't did you look at what that wildebeest was doing i mean he is a strong animal the alligator is a strong animal the alligator wants to pull him into the water to drown mm -hmm. him and he is because Jen, you said something about yeah. energy and what panic yes. does to your energy. I, I believe definitely when you start to panic and you lose hope, it drains your whole energy. You feel very depressed. Yeah. And you decide, you know what? I am giving up. I am not going ahead again. Mm -hmm. Especially when you have no one coming to help you. No one yes. coming to your aid, which is what we saw. With the build but bees. if you are strong will, you, you, you have that strong mind yeah. and you believe and you have faith that, listen, I am going to get out of it. Whoever on the sidelines watching, they can say what they want. I do what am they want. going forward. And with that mindset, you get that strength to go forward. Yeah. You get that strength. To go. And you also, and, and this is where your help come from that positive energy that message it, it, it's come like electricity you have yeah. the waves yeah. reaches the people yeah who i believe i say like 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 the if you, depending on your faith that god sends the angels to help you yeah. because there are people out there who watching on you don't know they're watching on admiring you you don't know them they're not your tribe and they are the ones coming oh, to help them. as what we have seen but in before the video. we get to the ones coming to the help i want us to think again about the wildebeest activity oh yes and you know when you're in trouble and, you, and you, you're being pulled you're being pulled mm -hmm. the wildebeest he fought and then he knew when to rest but his rest was not a drop down rest it's a conserve energy oh, yes. and rebuild energy to go again i really want us to look at that because that will be shows us what it takes to reinvent ourselves to get prepared to go on the next stage and yeah. adversity is not going to be called the focus was on the future Exactly. The focus was on the future. The focus wasn't on the present, but happening now. In spite the of the fact that the present was traumatic. Yeah, and, and challenges. And it says that. Yes. We go through a lot of hurdles, a lot of challenges. Some days we feel this is it. <laughs> Hello, our internet but, just went to <laughs> Yeah, and, and those who coming on, we, we just had. But we could not, and that's it. We could not panic. What we had to do immediately is think of, hey, we have people watching on we have invited you to join us we mm. are not giving up we are no. looking at the future because we find the message is important yes the message is important and even with a replay at least we know there's continuity yes we are not stopping and say okay see you tomorrow <laughs> ask you to come back tomorrow all we are asking that okay because of that little hitch 
that we may want you to we may go on the next 10 minutes to just complete the message that we are sending out to you and jennifer catherine you are so right because catherine is saying one of the things that limits our success is when we diminish our activity oh yes and it's a little thing listen you're so on the ball catherine it is not yes. a little thing it is our thing and just as that wildebeest you could see he was focused i am getting back on that bank you alligator you're not taking me yes, down yes you know and in spite of whoever it is whatever it is you, you know we come back to what yes. was driving that wildebeest we know we've got to have something that drives us that is bigger than us call it whatever you want to call it call it god call it faith call it nature whatever it is but it says that we've got to be firm in our conviction of where we want to go. And as, as Catherine is saying, it's not a little thing. It's yours. Protect you know, it. Terry Ann, we also, and I'm saying we again because this is us. All of us is in it. You see the language we use. We mentioned that before. Yeah. When we are speaking, watch who we tell the negative to. Mm -hmm. because you may have a friend that when you talk and you and you would know it don't have to be about business at all it's just about life, life. it's just about challenges it's just life. about your 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 future and your goals you would know when you start to chat from the time the response is a negative one in your mind you say okay I am not allowing that to get to me in coaching we say all the gremlins Mm -hmm. how to get rid of mm -hmm. the gremlins mm -hmm. and how to get rid of the gremlins as they say the negative in your mind you turn that to a, a positive. positive so if it is or you block these days hard or you cannot why are you going to start over again you know in your mind i am going to start over mm -hmm. I am going to do things or, differently. as Catherine says, it's a little thing, so I could stop it. Yeah. I could stop so when I want. Keep the yeah. conversation always positive. positive. Yeah. It's not that you're in a dream world, because that's something yeah. else that is said that you may be dreaming. Allow yourself to dream. What and your see dream that is. bigger picture yeah. and put yourself in it all the time. Put yourself in it. So that that mindset, that mm -hmm. support. Mm -hmm. It's important because if I don't have a positive mindset, if we didn't take this scenario here and immediately I thought of, okay, I'm not sure what happened with the internet, but we have the phone. Yep. And immediately a little challenge to get it going fast <laughs> enough, but you understand, we did admit that we started with a challenge returning. Let's be honest. We're very techie. Let's now. be honest. I yeah. know how to log out of my profile in Facebook on my laptop. Yes. I never practiced it on the phone. <laughs> and it was so, busy. <laughs> so, you know, um, but you have to, and, and you have, and that's when you're working together with someone. Yeah. Also, you're looking at, you don't want, and when you're looking at, at, at a partner to work with and an associate yeah. to work with, you're not looking at one who will panic at each stage. No, no. You're no. looking at one that will be, Thinking, stay on the focus stay yes on the, the track. as you said like mind yeah have the same sort yeah. of thinking to go along that journey with mm -hmm. you because the negatives keep coming all the time because guess what we talked about and we go back to our video now <clears throat> as you look at it i'm sure people would have put bets on wow who's going to win is it the alligator and the alligator is the environment all the things yes. that will will destroy your dream or keep you from going where you yes. want to go mm -hmm. or is that will the be going to survive because there was one point where he he Actually, was concerned and he allowed yes. the alligator to keep carrying him but then all of a sudden in stage left out of the water now look at this it's your environment you're a land animal your friends the people who are supposed to be your promoters are on land they are all looking at you yeah the wildebeest is facing the land if help is going to come it's going to come from there but here comes what two hippopotamus <laughs> outside not his he tribe is, not in your tribe not connected to him there is no relationship between wildebeest and hippopotamus they live most of their lives in the water 
and it comes back to the point that you're saying when you are focused and you know what you want to achieve you never know who is looking on admiring you cheering you on and in support of you and when things look darkest and most stressful yeah. that person comes on board to help and terry Ann, our other issue with many of us we are afraid to feel we believe that if we try something mm -hmm. and it doesn't work that's the end of it you know so if you have a, and we go back again if you are clear mm -hmm. on your skills and your talent mm -hmm. if you are clear who you are and, and we spoke a lot about that even if you're uncertain about skills and talents mm -hmm. but you're clear that i want to get some you believe in who you are move in the direction oh yes and you have Go to in the direction you know you have to affirm that on a daily basis yeah to keep going you have to affirm that so as the negatives come you have to keep affirming that yes i am doing this yes i you have to keep that in mind because there are so many negatives that comes up all the time mm -hmm. that could just throw you off track and as we talk about happiness let's talk about this these animals at the river and what happens oh yes so the hippopotamus come and they probably just stomp on the alligator and the alligator has to release the the will the beast leg so that it sees who who is bothering me We, when the money runs out when the family disintegrates yes. when when someone dies when the first plan didn't work the first idea boss as yeah. they say in Trinidad when people people's criticisms and their lack of support take you down yeah. you are wounded that's not the time to if you have to go in the water let the alligator take you yeah. you don't carry that's yourself not the in the time water. for depression it's not the time for it's depression not... you come out with look at that wildebeest look at his his anchor it's, it's hanging on by some tendons now is he more vulnerable in the world at that point because he can't run as fast as he would normally run he could be healed exactly and you know i have seen again welcome to those who are on board again with us um we had a challenge as we mentioned before with the internet and we decided to continue we live using the phone so if you see us just and you're wondering why we up on each other we because we're using the phone and it's too late for us to to, this, to, to this rotate is, this is the world the beast with a wounded leg to rotate <laughs> and we are using this opportunity yeah. to show how together yep we can continue on with our goals still send a message yes. it's just in a different format mm -hmm. you know it, but the mindset the message is the same and we are headed into the same direction that we were going yeah. before you know so this is and how we is this using. is what we are we are <laughs> yes. using at this stage so yes so we are looking at the different aspects we, you know, okay, we are so we talking about 
<laughs> we were talking about we started up you know talking about the entrepreneurial mindset mm -hmm. if you now come on and you weren't able to watch that video over the animal story that we have on the website look at it so we were using that to reference the points that we have mm -hmm. been making here and it was a we found it a very good analogy absolutely you know with life and and absolutely. what is happening outside there for those who may say well you know I'm not going to business. This is not about you going into business, we see. This is about your thinking, how you could be positive and really and achieve your goals life. in the third act. You However know? you choose to do it. And and again, one of the things that Jennifer and I are trying are doing at Connections 50 Plus is we want to help you, support you. Yes. These four uh, through the live chat is where we want to start conversations talk about yes. ideas feel free to contact us let's talk let's see where you want to go and how you want to get there um we'll be putting up the link to all of our videos on our youtube oh, yes. channel and we, we we are going to make this happen the people who are connecting with us our community we are going to be stars in that third act that's what we want to achieve you know and i want uh, just let me thank again all those who have been sending in their comments we have been really getting very you know so great we got to say hello to people shelly and collins yes shelly Ann is on with us with um, me marilyn is back catherine you, so many of you, Emra, thank you for coming back on, Donna, Margo, Dawn. Yeah, you know? And we really thank you all for, for uh, those are the supporters. These are what you see. And every week we've got a different group <laughs> yes, coming up. Who understand and <laughs> staring with, with us, us. <laughs> you know. And as I say, we want to be real. We yeah. want to be real. Tell it as it is and share our stories, which will in turn help uh, you you know into you going through the same thing i know also some people very hesitant or shy mm -hmm. to send in to ask questions you could inbox us you know yeah. if you don't want to just put it on the on live you could inbox us Definitely. and we would address the the mm -hmm. stage so taryn i think we have so them now week. for that that length of time <laughs> yes we thank you for staying on we ask you of course to tell your friends we're going to be on every wednesday and we promise you if for some week, reason we hope to have a guest yes oh yes <laughs> we're going to have a guest because we found it's so important to hear listen to other people's stories especially the success stories we as long you have been able to success reach is a journey i'm now saying that and the i see it as success. success yes so I, I it's not about you haven't reached anywhere or you're not rich or you're not no 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 life you are living life you're living a happy life you are living a fulfilled life you're successful yeah so we're going to bring in we're going to hopefully not hopefully i'm sure we're going to use a big screen <laughs> so so we're going to have all three persons on board we're going to have a big big router we're <laughs> going to pray that the internet doesn't shut down <laughs> for whatever reason but you know what this is our third discussion yeah and i see these are the challenges and i don't even see challenges as no. a learning lesson because when we leave here now as we shut down we're going to find out okay if this should happen again what should we do maybe some other thing went wrong nothing to do with technology maybe us something we may just you have know? not known something yes yeah so we take all this in stride so thank you thank you very much we're gonna put the um i've sent out the youtube link, link. Yeah, so at least you could go on youtube all those with us here now can go back to the replay what we will try to do is see to tell us if what they we to talk could tie in the when we got um cut off there we when we lost contact merge. with you we will see we have to now hire expert <laughs> to merge it for us so it we will be edit. <laughs> we <laughs> learn how to edit so we would have at least one video, video. running for you yes. 
thanks so much again let us know how you felt about today's yes. chat let us know what else you would like well, us to talk, talk about, about. Yes. you know we want to really chat about what you want this it's is all about you it's you know so we say yeah. it is about you and it's about your journey and your future so have a great great thank evening you, thank you thank you thank you and bye <laughs> understanding what went on okay bye, bye. all right great.